I am super excited to share some new tools with you. This is the adjustable quilt strip ruler available from Off The Wall Quilt. Let's see how it works. I'm Andy. Welcome to True Blue Quilts, a place to enjoy, experiment, and excel as you quilt. Okay, I'm opening up my adjustable quilt strip ruler. There's some hardware included and it comes in two pieces, this uh, orange guide and the actual ruler that is a nice fluorescent green. So first we need to Peel off the backing. This is slip stop. It's kind of that sandpaper tape and I am going to apply it to the finger guard. There's a protective ridge right here that's gonna protect my fingers. So I wanna turn this over because I wanna be able to use that finger guide. So I'm applying this back. So I can tell the letters are backwards. So I'm on the back of my ruler and I'm gonna press that tape into place right along the edge underneath that finger guard. And then there are wide uh, parts of those circles and narrower edges so you can feel you want the wider edge up so that I can put the um, bolts in. Once I get everything apart, I've got a screw and a wing nut, so I'm going to put that first screw in place and tighten it down, and then, okay, so the beauty of this ruler is that once I set the measurement, I am done thinking about numbers. I can just cut all day long until I need a strip of a different size. I'm gonna be cutting binding today. So I'm gonna loosen those bolts that I just inserted. I'm gonna slide my ruler over to two and a quarter. And that is the other great feature of the adjustable quilt strip ruler is that it has quarter and eighth inch markings, so you can get the exact strip size you need. So, like I said, I'm just adjusting that. I'm going to make sure that my measurements are at two and a quarter on all three positions. And now I'm ready to cut. So I've got some extra wide backing material that I'm going to go ahead and use for my binding as well. And there are about eight layers and that is going to work just fine. The orange guide on the bottom, that is the lip that goes right up against my fabric. That's why I don't have to worry about checking the numbers anymore because it's set with that orange piece. Once the slip stop tape is in place, that ruler's not going anywhere, so I can just apply a little bit of pressure and I didn't get all through through those layers with that, but I've got my binding strip cut. And as I said, this is my extra long um, 
backing. So just one more cut on that. And so I'll slide that into place. Again, I'm not worried about numbers. I know I said it correctly. I'm just worried about getting that orange piece in place and cutting my binding strips. Tomorrow I'll be ready for uh, two and a half inch strips. I might need three and seven eighths, so it would be very easy to adjust the ruler to those positions. Visit offthewallquilt.com to order your adjustable quilt strip ruler. Use the discount code TRUEBLUE to receive $5 off your purchase. The adjustable quilt strip ruler helps you enjoy the cutting process, experiment with different strip sizes, and excel as you piece your next quilt block. If you are looking for design ideas, check out the video below where I show you how to make a nine patch star block. And I'll be back next week with more quilty goodness. Until then, happy stitching!